Black Cajun Sports is here with my young fella holding, let me see your name. Well, why they give you that? You are the what? The man got some buckets for me. You the MVP of this really, really outstanding early season matchup. You know, I chatted to you before the game and I said, you know, Daniel, I, I, I talk to Jason all the time about your recruitment and I, I, I feel like, you know, it's, it's a little underwhelming at, the, at right now. But after tonight, I told you, if you went out there, you, you, you played some good defense, which you did, Justin, he got some buckets, but he never really impacted the game. And you, Score what? 27? Really? 27 yeah. points. 27 points. Talk to me. Did you come out here intending to really just lead your team offensively, make sure you guys got some buckets? Well, for, for me, I, I feel like that's my job every game, you know, to, to go out, get, get buckets, and then play hard, have all that energy. So, you know, I just came out knowing, knowing that day in my bag I had their back. So, you know, everything just went out good. Now, this really isn't a surprise. Last game you guys played, you won the 6A state championship, right? So you come out this year, you beat one of the, I mean, two, three best programs in the, in the state and one of the top teams in the country. Does that set the bench for what you're looking for the rest of this season? Yeah, definitely does for sure. Now, now, now we know what teams are, are going to be like the whole season. So now, you know, we have to come out. Same thing, stay disciplined, stay poised, and then have the same results every game. Now back to your recruitment. Are you kind of settled in? Are you wide open? Do you have a, a leader in the clubhouse? What's going on with that? Um, I have offers from East Stroudsburg, Kutztown, and Jacksonville University. Just Jacksonville on the Division One level? Yeah, that, that's only Division One. Well, I, I have one of my friends here. He's a coach. Uh, a A R has he demonstrated that he can play on the Division One level tonight? Uh, as you call him, abracadabra. <laughs> uh, he he is a typical typical low major, mid major, uh, wing forward. Uh, stepped up in the second half and showed me some things uh, from the perimeter, making two huge contested threes uh, to kind of take control of, of the third quarter for for Redding. Uh, the one thing that he did consistently that he touched on was he was a factor on the defense end of the floor. Mm -hmm. uh, Justin Edwards is obviously a very, very, very good basketball player and has a bright future. Uh, but Daniel came out and you know went toe to toe with him and, and ultimately came out on top and helped his team not only scoring points but on the offensive glass.